step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, think real hard about what you wanna be. Step four, fuck everybody, just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Are Amy Roback and TJ Holmes's exes dating? A look at the year-long drama. Amy Roback and TJ Holmes have been in the news this week with the launch of their new podcast. But the couple's coming out party over the last few days, which included their first red carpet outing, was essentially trumped on Tuesday by reports that their former spouses are dating. According to People, Melrose Play star Andrew Shu and Marilee Fiebig, whom Roback and Holmes wed in 2013, respectively, have developed a romantic connection. Each couple separated over the summer of 2022, however, Roback and Holmes maintained on their podcast they did not cheat. It's been nearly one year since Holmes and Roback's relationship was outed in the press. Earlier this year, the former Good Morning America journalists departed ABC amid their romance. Here's a look back at the drama that's been resurfaced this week. November 30, 2022. The Daily Mail published photos of ABC anchors looking cozy on multiple occasions around New York. Holmes and Roback, who co-hosted GMA3, were married to Fiebig and Melrose Place star Andrew Shu, respectively. They were both married since 2010. A source told People the journalists had been dating in the open and claimed they both separated from their spouses over the summer. This was two consenting adults who were each separated. They both broke up with their spouses in August within weeks of each other, an insider claimed. The relationship didn't start until after that. Holmes and Roback began co-hosting the Good Morning America spin-off in 2020. December 1, 2022. Holmes and Roback hosted GMA3 as planned, but made no mention of their romance. Who is looking forward to the weekend? Holmes asked at the top of the show. Uh, me. Roback laughed. December 4, 2022. It was widely reported that Holmes had prior interoffice affairs before dating Roback, and while married to Fiebig. He allegedly had a years-long affair with a former GMA3 producer from 2016 to 2019. December 5, 2022. Yahoo Entertainment confirmed Roback and Holmes were temporarily sidelined amid public scrutiny over their romance. ABC News President Kim Godwin told employees during an editorial call that while the consensual relationship is not a violation of company policy, the network is trying to work through what's best for the organization as the pair's relationship has become a distraction. A source told Yahoo it's a day-by-day -day situation, but the two never returned on air. December 12, 2022 Holmes and Roback were still sidelined amid an ongoing investigation by ABC. Godwin addressed the situation in a memo to staffers and said the pair will remain off-air pending the completion of an internal review, with a rotation of anchors filling in on GMA3. TJ Holmes, here with girlfriend Amy Roback, reached divorce settlement with Marilee Fiebig. Brian Better slash New York Roadrunners via Getty Images, via Instagram. December 28, 2022. Holmes filed for divorce from Fiebig, his wife of nearly 13 years. January 4, 2023. Fiebig broke her silence amid Holmes going public with Roback. During the holiday season and in light of the challenging times, Marilee's sole focus has remained on the overall best interest of her nine-year-old daughter, Lehman said in the statement. To that end TJ's lawyer and I have been working together to move their divorce forward privately, expeditiously, and as amicably as possible. Fiebig's lawyer called out how Holmes has been handling the situation. Notwithstanding, we continue to be disappointed by TJ's lack of discretion, respect and sensitivity toward Marilee and the party's daughter, Lehman added. Marilee has been touched by the outpouring of support and looks forward to a new beginning in this new year. January 27, 2023. 
After weeks of speculation, Roback and Holmes were officially ousted from the network. They both hired high-profile lawyers for mediation and it was reported they walked away with a hefty settlement. After several productive conversations with Amy Roback and TJ Holmes about different options, we all agreed it's best for everyone that they move on from ABC News, a spokesperson told Yahoo. We recognize their talent and commitment over the years and are thankful for their contributions. ABC reportedly accused both journalists of various forms of misconduct to justify the firings. Roback was allegedly accused of having liquor bottles in her dressing room, a violation of company policy, which an insider called ridiculous as some were sent to her from top network executives. She was also accused of showing up to work drunk after attending last year's college football national championship, which a source close to the reporter called insane and claimed she was just tired. As for Holmes, it was widely reported he had at least three affairs in the workplace. All three women were reportedly subordinates. ABC allegedly claimed in mediation that Roback and Holmes did not handle their office romance appropriately and that they made some staffers uncomfortable, according to TMZ. One insider called the whole thing a witch hunt. March 17, 2023. Roback and Shu quietly finalized their divorce. They do not share any children, but amicably divided their assets through mediation and agreed to share custody of their dog. August 28, 2023. Months after their departure from ABC News, the couple proved they are still going strong. The pair broke their Instagram silence and shared matching black and white photos of their running gear. Hashtag NYC Marathon 2023. October 14, 2023. Holmes and Feebig reached a divorce settlement, according to multiple reports. The former couple shares a 10-year-old daughter, Sabine. Details of the agreement are unclear. December 1, 2023. After more than a year together, Roback and Holmes made their first red carpet appearance as a couple at iHeartRadio's Jingle Ball 2023 in Los Angeles. December 5, 2023. The duo launched their new podcast Amy and TJ in which they break their silence about their relationship and exit from ABC News. Holmes denied cheating on our spouses and said they were both in divorce proceedings when they got together. We're the folks who lost the jobs we love because we love each other, he added. Both Holmes and Roback addressed mental health issues they faced in the wake of the scandal, although they said there was nothing scandalous about their relationship. They shared that they were very close to telling their bosses at the network about their romance before it was outed in the press. Right before the pictures came out, we thought, should we tell them what's going on? And we thought, let's just get these divorces cleaned up and then let's do it, Roback shared, noting they had every intention of doing it and we didn't believe, and I don't think we still do believe, we were doing anything technically wrong. Holmes chimed in. If we'd have put out statements about divorces, and then people found out we were dating, they would raise some eyebrows and go, ooh, okay, that's still an interesting topic. But doing it this way, the story became mainstream when, the press, is able to say, morning show stars suspended. That's now a major story given the brand we were attached to, and we knew that that was going to be a big deal. Read more, the buzziest revelations from the podcast. Hours after the podcast launched, they were essentially one-upped by juicier gossip, the pair's exes, Shu and Feebig, are reportedly dating, per people. Page 6, which first reported the news, claimed Shu and Feebig have been dating for six months. They allegedly bonded over their former spouse's alleged affair. It turned into something else, and they're connected over their values. It's bigger than the affair now, one source claimed. Too long, it hurts too hard.